New York is about its people, it's about its diversity, it's about its character. And when you're here, you feel a sense of every hand that has pieced this place together. I find it amazing that the first condo and the first hotel that I get to design in New York City is actually framed on one side by the High Line and on the other side by the Hudson River. I mean, I can't think of a better location. This location is magical and what it needs is magical architecture. Architecture literally is the art and science of turning fiction into fact, the pragmatic into the poetic. Well, we all kind of fell in love with these waltzing, twisting towers by the river. Building is a challenge and it's very rewarding. It attracts the best and the brightest. We have a selection of artists all working on one spot. I would say that Zeal built the vision. My name is Zeal Feldman. I'm the founder and chairman of HFZ Capital Group. Neil Jacobs, CEO of Sixensis. I am Bjarke Ingels. I'm an architect, and I'm the founder of the Bjarke Ingels Group, or simply BIG. My name is Enzo Enea, and my firm is Enea Landscape Architecture. My name is Michael Gabellini. Hi, Kim Shepard. Our firm is Gabellini Shepard Associates. So I'm French. My name is Dorothée Boissier, and I'm working with my husband, Patrick. The name of the studio is Gilson Boissier. For me, it's a very powerful building. It's really a piece of architecture. Then after when you're coming to design and how you integrate the life into a building, it's something very different. The way Bjarke Ingels designed this building is that people don't live stacked on top of each other. They live at one tiny incremental turn stacked on one another. Two buildings can actually be thoughtful towards each other. The tower and the water moves away and allowing the High Line Tower to actually look towards the Hudson and see the sunset. The intention is that it becomes one design, that the outdoor and the indoor come together aesthetically. The nature of this thing offers interior spatial possibilities in which it's created this intense vibrancy. There is really nothing standard about this. It is custom to a T. Today, it's not simple to surprise people. And, and it's the little things that surprise people. Our visionaries have been directed to create a celebration of the best life has to offer. The city will become a canvas, allowing each of those voices to tell the story. Now it's up for the inhabitants to pick up where we left off, to make it their home.